Bill the date for this, our main event of the evening. Four years, the difference in age between these two fighters with similar height and some differences in reach. All right, now to get us started, here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Dan Bergliata. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas. <laughs> Championship of the world. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding a professional record of 17 wins, 7 losses. He stands 5 feet 9 inches tall, weighing in at 135 pounds. Fighting at a couple of Hawaii, introducing the challenger, Luis De La Samurai. Small And now introducing the champion, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding a professional record of 13 wins, one loss. He stands 5 feet 11 inches tall, weighing in at 135 pounds. Fighting out of Glendale, Arizona, USA, presenting, leading, defending, undisputed UFC bantamweight champion of the world. Sugar, Sean O'Malley! All right, this is for the UFC Championship. I want you to obey my commands at all times, protect yourself at all times, on a nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, back your corners, but not fall. that we dream of as MMA fans. All right, let's go. Let's get those hands going now. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by his kick. Well, collar tie. Well, it's one thing to have length. It's another thing to use it, and he does it as well as anyone. Nice kick there by O'Malley. All right, early round one here. Big reach advantage, DC. We'll see if he can employ that patented jet. Yes, he has to maintain distance. He's the taller guy. So every time his opponent tries to enter, he's going to have to take something on the way inside. Oh! He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Powerful leg kick lands. Stuffs the takedown, no problem. Right hand punches the twist. Oh. Big shots exchanged in the pocket there. Nice punch there by O'Malley. They're certainly getting after it early. Man, it's almost like he's got a range finder out there. Just too easy as he connects with another good series of punches. There. If you're boxing this guy and only boxing him, you will be in trouble. He changes the angle, finds the right spot to land that punch to the head from the clinch. He's got a punch to the head. He cannot take this many shots to the head. All right, he engages in the single collar tie. Beautiful punch. Stuffs the takedown there. How good is his takedown defense? All right, so he lands another jab now, just snapping that thing off. I believe that the jab was lost in mixed martial arts initially. But now it has been found, and it's been found by this young man in this octagon tonight. 
trying to double up on that jab. I'm gonna have the clinch position. And they separate. That one appeared to stun him. He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Holding on to him here, not really doing too much, perhaps just looking to recover. Now goes the toss as he takes him down. Now we'll see what he can do. Right into side control. He got his foot on the hip, and now he's throwing up a triangle attempt. He's gonna try to move his left arm across to get pressure on the choke. There he is, he's moving to the finishing position. Now watch, he goes parallel right next to his opponent. When it's time to finish. And this might just be a matter of time. He got it. He got it, John. How about it? Gets the win by submission. Beautifully executed there on the ground. as he gets it done by submission tonight, champ. He was able to get the fight to the ground exactly where he wanted it. Eventually, his opponent gave him an opportunity to get a submission. He did that, and he should be very proud of the work he did tonight in the octagon. So there he is, the UFC Bantamweight Champion, closing the show tonight with a spectacular submission. It is gonna take a special performance to dethrone this man at 135 pounds. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Mergliata has called a stop to this contest at three minutes, 17 seconds of the very first round. For the winner by submission, There's a new sheriff in town. There he is, the new UFC Bantamweight Champion of the World. And what a way to get the job done here tonight as he submits the reigning defending UFC Bantamweight Champion. This is what you love to see. Somebody get belted in the UFC for the first time. The celebration is on in the corner.